to Ian's vlog. And, Tanya. and Tanya's vlog. It's actually a very, very nice place. It's boiling hot, absolutely sweltering. And yeah, yesterday we sampled Greek food for the first time, which is something I was looking forward to. Massive portions, big portions. Uh, that yeah, food. It's a big portion. Uh, and then this. And then this morning for breakfast we had um, something else which I sampled for the first time which I've been looking forward to is Greek yogurt which was delicious, really really delicious. I'll be having that for my breakfast every morning really and yeah today we're going out we're going out to the village the town should I say I think I think it's actually the capital of Santorini but it's called Fira. This is the hotel where we are. there you can see the, the the beautiful shades of blue and of course now oh, there we go I bought it. <laughs> yeah this is like the um, I mean the hotel is literally uh, seven steps away from the beach and there's kind of a beach promenade here and this beach promenade of course is lined with cocktail bars and restaurants and all the rest of it and you would expect like silly prices at, oh look at that ah lovely yeah look at those figs yeah lovely one problem no problem let me try it Oh, look at the freshness of that. No problem, no problem. Loca, mm. loca. Santorini, good. Santorini? Santorini, Santorini. loca. The grapes, good grapes. Yes, thank you. Okay. How much are the figs? How much are the figs? 10 euro box. 10 euro? It's small. No, a small one. Five. Five. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Hey. No, 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 good morning. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We sleep well <laughs> no, uh, morning, this morning. Yeah. 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 Have you got five euro? Yeah, I think it's just what I need, some fresh, fresh fruit. This one is okay. No way, I couldn't get more than three. Five, five euro. Wait. Thank you very much. Oh. Okay, boss. No no See you later. Yeah, this is the beautiful promenade uh, which leads uh, be between the beach and and all the hotels and some beautiful restaurants here really and, and cocktail bars and and all the rest of it shisha bars you name it it's everything here Even... yeah we're in fira but it's 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 also pronounced with the th like a fira or whatever um it's completely different to where we are uh, it, it's actually a very nice place. Shall we have a look around at Fira or Fira on the island? It's the capital of the island, Santorini. Ooh. Hills everywhere. There we go. Look, look at this beautiful viewpoint. Yeah. 
I mean, obviously it'd be even more beautiful if that disgusting cruise ship down there was somewhere, somewhere else. is of course world famous and when I say world famous that is not an understatement for its sunsets and we're not going to be here for sunset but we are going to we are going to uh, experience the sunset at some point before we go back um, but th this is all sort of time is it now it's uh, it's about more than about six o'clock and the sun goes down probably in about two hours time but you can see it's very very low at the moment um, throwing off a really nice atmosphere yeah we're gonna have a bit of a hairy ride you're gonna have a bumpy ride on a on a Greek bus I'm gonna be like Zorba bumping up and down on, the, on these on these roads I'll show you where we are and where we're going right that's where we are we're in Fira the island obviously and we're gonna have to go back to, to Kamari to Kamari village. There you go, that's where we are. You too, mate. Yeah, it's time to eat and we had a, we had a little image uh, earlier on today of Zorba the Greek on the bus well it's more complicated we've got Shirley Valentine now <laughs> so my name is if you have any questions about the menu or if you need information feel free to ask yeah thank you and uh, I also want to inform you that for today we have a red snapper special for two people so no fish so yeah comes with rice fries and uh, grilled veggies so that's all right with you yeah Okay. So, yeah. And if I could recommend any appetizer, uh, since you go with seafood, go for the shrimp kataifi. It's the first one. Uh, it's shrimp kataifi, it's a shrimp in a pastry looking like nest. Very thin pastry. And you dip it in the sweet chili sauce and you eat it, it's literally spot on. Yeah, that's your recommendation and, you know, we go with that, yeah. Perfect, thank you for trusting. Go with that. Uh, would you like some wine or beer? Uh, the lady will take a glass of white wine. Yeah, the rest the restaurant was actually um, it was recommended to us by by the hotel, and we, we did mention that now. So they seem to be taking care of us. It's a good thing. I'm happy. Yeah, we're here on the beach, and the the main course has just been served up, and it is of course it's one of my favourites, one of my all time favourite fish, and it is a recommendation of the day. So it's a fresh catch, and it is the red snapper. <laughs> so. The Michael, the guy that we met before, he was kind enough to um, debone the fish. So let's take a look around and see what he's brought us to go with that thing. There we go, we've got some uh, grilled aubergine, looking very tasty. On this side of the table is, for me, the chips. On that side of the table, of course, is for her, it's the rice and the snapper there 
in all its beauty with what did he say a lemon uh, lemon olive oil and something else sauce or dressing to go with the fish so uh, without further ado let's get into this beast Not really sure how this works with the sun lounges with, with the sunbeds if you have to pay for them or if they're private or if they're public but we just kind of sat down and you know the only thing which is strange about the whole experience is being on the beach with black sand baby black sun let's take a look around it's a really busy day it's a really stormy day it's a stormy day today it's a day of unsettled ocean activity today which of course is the day that we're actually going on a catamaran five-hour catamaran journey that's going to be fun take the ground Yeah, the sea's a bit rough out there today and I'm not saying I'm worried about the afternoon's catamaran trip around the island but I'm a little bit concerned <laughs> let's put it that way uh, anyhow let's take a look around we've got black beaches we've got windy day we've got Sunday on Santorini in Kamari a beautiful little village nestled on the where are we? We're going to be on the east, on the southern east coast of the island of Santorini. That's where we are, the southeast of the coast. So we'll just take a look around and see some of the beautiful, beautiful Greek scenes, the blue skies, the, the straw umbrellas, the, the black beach band. <laughs> no way. Oh, really good. Foot massage. No, thank you. We're going on a boat trip, <laughs> and I think the boat's over there actually. No, no, it can't be. That's the opposite key. This is the group we're with at the moment and we're being taken by the guide at the moment to the it's a catamaran it's going to be like something like a five hour trip um, we're going to go and see a lot of interesting things including volcanic sites and different bays red bay blue bay all the rest of it and then there's going to be some food and some drink and some swimming and it's just what we need because Today is particularly a very hot day. That's the captain up there. It's the prettiest looking captain that I've ever seen of a boat, I'll tell you that. Yeah, anyhow, here we go, we're on the way to... I've got no idea where we're on the way to, but it's absolutely beautiful out here on the sea. It is. There's an absolutely gorgeous breeze, cooling everything down. <laughs> Darling, you happy? <laughs> She's happy. Let's take a look around, huh? Yeah, I think, I think actually they, um, I think somehow they, they could have overbooked because we were transferred onto a smaller boat just at the last minute and happy days yeah we're really into the trip now really getting on with it now in fact it's almost like a race going on there's boats on the left side and the right side and this is beautiful it really is beautiful let's take a look around Right in the front of the boat here. I just hope that we don't have the first stop. 
stop coming up soon. I think one of the sites that we should be passing by, it's not stopping but passing by, is the Red Beach, which doesn't sound very, very, um, very important or freezing to me. But I think it's over there somewhere. Oh yeah, the Red Beach and the White Beach. There we go. Yeah. That's the red one, and that's the white one over there. She's going to tell us now. Hi, <laughs> Gonna be a bumpy ride. We'll keep the camera running for this one. Are you ready, Daddy? Yeah. It's gonna be a bumpy ride. Get the glasses. Get the glasses. Get them away. Well, everybody is vacating the front of the boat. They're gonna get wet. They're gonna get bumped. But we're staying. Pirates of the Caribbean! Pirates of the Caribbean playing. <laughs> Absolutely brilliant. Oh, this is the best trip I've ever been on, really. Whoa, that's a big one. Whoa! Yeah, as we get closer and closer to the, to the volcanic uh, island, we uh, we were talking about we were laughing about pirates of the Caribbean during the stormy waters over there. I think I've just really found the black pearl. Why well, is the blue pearl actually? Let's have a look. Just about slowing down now, and the crew are going to dock up slightly, slightly offshore. In fact, there is no shore basically because the volcano just spewed right down to the water side, and we're in kind of a bay where everything's changing colour. The sea's changing colour. The rocks are changing colour, and it is completely—it's—it's it's, it's amazing, really. I mean, to think that this is volcanic spew. So let's have a look around. I think we're going in the water too. I think we're going to go and bubble up some volcanic springs. Yeah, apparently um, we're going to be swimming over hot springs now because it's live. The, the volcano. I'm on my own. I wasn't, that wasn't supposed to be happening. Let's take a look at the boat. <sighs> yeah, this is absolutely beautiful, Danny. <laughs> Go and swim. Go to the rocks. No, it's... Uh, <laughs> yeah, you can get all the. I don't know. Jellyfish. No. Joking. No. Joking. 
joking. Yeah, it was delicious really, it was freshly made, it was homemade, it was made with lots of love and it was made by the crew members, so you know, well appreciate that really. Um, the way it goes at the moment, the sun's going down over the, uh, the cliffs over there, let's take a look around, huh? there we go. Yeah, here we are. We are in. Um, I'm just gonna come. Oh yeah, you can come as well. If you want to take me, it's no problem. So, he's the man. Yeah. He's the man. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, Torin is lovely. <laughs> <laughs> we enjoy it. Yeah, here we are. We've got the sun going down in about half an hour. We're going to yes. have some delicious food off this guy here. Yes. And then we're going to take some pictures and maybe a couple of movies of the sun going down. The famous movie yeah. the sun going down. Here we are in the, the top of the island of Santorini and we're here to get we're here to get the sun going down because it's one of the most spectacular things you can see in the East Mediterranean. That's where we are at the moment. And time's it now. The time is 7, 7 27 and in about half an hour the sun's going down over there. And we've got quite good tables here, we've got to catch it. So. Let's wait for that, man. Huh? 